What's going on guys? I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. You guys haven't done a vlog in forever. What is this? What is this this sorcery? Okay, well, we haven't done one in a while. So I figured, whoa, we got a big bump. Woo, okay. So we haven't done one in a while. So I figured, you know, I might as well go and do one. I need to get out of the house. I'm going crazy. So let's do a vlog to see what happens and uh, let's see what we can get ourselves into today. that I've posted on Facebook with the uh, with Santa Claus and he's like he's in the kid's house and like a little girl comes downstairs she's like Santa Santa and he's like Shh. he's like there can be no witnesses and pulls out a silence pistol and shoots her in the head I, didn't see that. <laughs> I was like <laughs> I was like what the fuck <laughs> He said there could be no witnesses and pulls out a silence pistol and just shoots her <laughs> and then starts eating cookies and milk like it was like it was no deal like it's like whatever I was like I want to see Santa in this detail It's our little our little uh, deer buddies out today in our normal our normal spot Call this Piss Creek. It, it feels so weird coming out here, and it's like, because we're used to seeing so many tree, or like you know, leaves and everything, and it's like that's all you see, and now it's like you can look down straight at the water from here. It all bears. So we're at one of our favorite fishing spots. A couple weeks ago, what was it, like three weeks ago, Seth, that it flooded out here? Yeah, it flooded during the last big rain we got. Yeah, so we had one big rain a couple weeks ago, and it flooded out here, and the water was way up. Like, we couldn't even stand out here where we are now. There was so much water. And now it's so low, you can literally walk across, and it probably won't go past your knees. So we can actually walk out here now. Um, before, like I said, the water was so high that you couldn't even walk out here where we are now. Like you would literally, you'd go past your waist. But now you can walk out there and it wouldn't even go up to your knees, like at all. Came out here before and uh, this is actually where we did the video where we cut the fish open and everything. Um, Whoop, get through here. Came out here before and I literally can't ever get a bite. But whenever Seth comes out here, it's either he'll get one bite or he'll get like 50 bites. But me, I'd be lucky if I can ever catch anything out here. But it's still one of our favorite places because the scenery is so nice. Last time we were here, when uh, I got my bait stuck out in the uh, water over there, the uh, when Seth was walking in the water, these rocks here were actually up to, uh, the water was up to his knees when he was standing on those. So that's how you can tell how much water we've actually lost over here. You could not even go out this far into the water before. Ah. So we saw some crawdads and stuff under the water. 
moving around. So we're gonna try and put the GoPro under the water and see if we can get any cool shots of some of the underwater stuff going on. Um, I didn't bring my pole that I usually use when I mount the GoPro to it for like underwater shots and stuff. So I'm just gonna find a really big stick that'll work just as well. Oh, he's sleeping. Didn't take long for you to catch a fish already. This is fucked. Like it's through the bottom of his fucking mouth. He got a piercing. I don't know if there's anything I can do for that. I don't even know how it's possible. Oh yeah, that's messing. That's on there good. Like all three prongs are through the bottom of his mouth. Here, fit, turn it towards me. <laughs> oh, jeez, that looks rough. That's like. Uh, like a tongue piercing at Hot Topic gone wrong right there. Are we going to have to just kill it or? Oh, he's bleeding out really bad too. Yep. He's probably done for. He's a bleeder. Oh. Here. Need to find a rock here somewhere. Look away, kids. You know, we really messed up. After a fierce battle. <laughs> <laughs> After a fierce battle with the fish people, Seth has claimed his trophy. The fish king is dead. <laughs> the trout prince. Kinda smell like horse shit. Does it smell like blood? We just found some gloves in the ground <laughs> that we uh, we think they might have been used in a murder. I think uh, there's still a bit of blood on them, but uh, yeah. So they're not. That's probably a twenty-five dollar pair of gloves. Well, so someone's life was taken for twenty-five dollars. I didn't have the right lens on this, on the camera for. <coughs> All right, so this is one of our favorite places to go. This is an out, old outlook. It's, uh, as you can see here. Uh, I'm not sure if you guys can see this or not. Uh, it's kind of hard to see it from here. There used to be a uh, an old fire look at the very top of this little mountain area up here. We're gonna go up there. We got a little sugar for your eyes. So, I like to come up here all the time. It's really nice up here. See the mountains and whatnot. Elevation 4,100 feet. 4,100 feet. Hell yeah. I didn't bring my hoodie, <laughs> so I'm freezing my ass off already. I know, it's like every time I come up here, I always, I get about halfway up there and I'm like, <laughs> just, just leave me, just leave me behind. The funny thing is, the very first time I ever came up here, I, uh, <laughs> I had, <laughs> what did I have? I had like a, I had a pitch black Mountain Dew and, uh, and a pack of white donuts on me. <laughs> and so, my fat ass walking up here 
up this mountain, up this trail. I'm busy eating white donuts. So, trying to be healthy and losing my breath from walking up this mountain. And I'm like dying as I'm trying to swallow donuts. I'm so ashamed. But it's worth it, it's nice. And I need the exercise anyway, but I don't get enough exercise at all. Oh, fuck. So we finally made it to the top. This is what it looks like. I almost died for this, guys. Just remember that. It's such a nice view. Yeah, the rain over there and... God, it's clear out there toward Mount Roger. And the cool thing is, this used to be a watchtower, like a fire tower, and ironically it, uh, what is it, burned down so I caught fire to it or something? Like some arson or something like that. So it's, it sucks that it's not here anymore because we will be way up there. Getting even higher distance shots than this. So it's kind of unfortunate that it's not here anymore because that'd be really cool. But um, even as it is now, it's a really cool spot to uh, to go and just look over the mountains and, and whatnot and watch the sun go down and everything. If I fall to my death, make sure this vlog footage makes it to the internet. Woohoo! That is a far way down. You look like you're on the edge of the world there. He's down there on the bottom of the mountain now. This is so crazy. It's like Look how high up we are. Sounds like he's super close to us now, doesn't he? He's gonna be passing right under us down here, I think. And now, the trek back down the mountain. <laughs> oh God. I'm gonna be filming this tomorrow. And I still got to work tonight. Oh God, I'm gonna die. <laughs>